Kung kasing tanda mo, kilala mo yan. Kilala mo yan dalawang players na yan. Kilala mo ba yan? Pamaya, uh, kung hindi mo kilala, papakilala ko sa'yo. But anyway, uh, dahil po nanalo po ang New York Knicks at saka ang Indiana Pacers, we're gonna see a classic matchup. And this is the example. Uh, pero dito sa video na ito, meron lang akong nalaman. Ano? And I, I just wanted to share with you. Natuwa ako kasi, no? So obviously, um, Jalen Bronson is the, the best player right now for the uh, New York Knicks. Kung ayaw maniwala, eh, check mo na lang itong stats na ito. Ewan ko nakikita nyo, pero that's a 40-point um, game uh, at least for the four games. Yung last game niya, 39, pero consider pa rin. And uh, it's really a story of ano, itong si Jalen Bronson. Uh, story of, uh, kumbaga, sa una, hindi ganong kagaling. Uh, or hindi pa nabibigyan ng ganong opportunity. In fact, um, siya po, itong si Jalen Bronson, was, wasn't was actually picked at all uh, high in the draft. Uh, second round, 33rd yata, no? So, pakita ko lang to sa inyo, ha? Ito yan, ha? So, he's only 27 years old. And kung titignan nyo dito, he was picked, uh, uh, nakasulat ah, dito, 33rd in the second, uh, ano? Uh, but that's not what I'm here. I'm here because uh, classic matchup nga, no? And alamang ko yung tatay niya uh, played for the New York Knicks as well. Uh, and um, ang coincidentally, uh, yung tatay niya uh, who played for the New York Knicks, uh, bangkuan po siya nung panahon na yan. Uh, at uh, natalo po yung tatay. Uh, yung, Indi yung New York Knicks, ito yung series na yun eh. The 2000 NBA, this was the last time that the New York Knicks and uh, uh, Indiana Pacers met. Uh, from what I've heard, no, that, so that was a long time ago. It, um, yeah, four two, four two for the uh, Indiana Pacers. Uh, so tingnan natin yung makabawi. At etong tatay niya, ito pa yung trivia ko. Naglaro pala sa Hinebra yung tatay niya. Ito yung ano? Ito yung uh, prueba. Medyo magulo yung pagkakapakita ko. So, but 1998, ito yung uh, career po ni uh, Rick Bronson. Uh, 1995, played for the Adelaide at 36ers. And then, nag-Hinebra uh, noong 1998, bago siya nag-NBA. And then, the New York Knicks siya, naglaro siya nung back in the 2000. He also played for the Boston Celtics. Nakita nyo dito, no? So, uh, that's just, there's just a connection between the Filipino uh, and uh, ito kay Bronson. So, I think, um, <coughs> ano lang, <coughs> um, uh, parang ang, ang sarap isipin, no? Jalen Bronson, uh, connected to the Philippines and now connected to Indiana Pacers, New York Knicks, tatay niya. <coughs> May pagkakataon siya makabawi. Uh, although, honestly speaking, I don't think uh, if he's the one doing all the heavy lifting, uh, I don't think uh, they're going to win against the Indiana Pacers, honestly speaking. Um, man unless, kasi mas balance yung Indiana Pacers. Eh, pero sabi nga nila, yung uh, mga tao sabi, Indiana Pacers doesn't have good defense. So baka kainin lang ng buhay ni Jalen Brunson. If that's the case, then I wouldn't be surprised if New York Knicks wins it. But I'm 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 just picking the more balanced team, uh, ang Indiana Pacers, this one. But uh, yun. You know, I, I, di ko alam kung kilala nyo, no? Classic matchup, Knicks versus Pacers. And then tatay niya pala naglaro sa Hinebra. At naglaro din sa New York Knicks. Coincident? 